And it's happened during Monday night prayer in Patterson, New Jersey. Days later, worshipers tell CBS 2's Lisa Rosner they're concerned every time they go to pray. Inside Masjid Abu Bakr Islamic Congregation of New Jersey, anyone arriving late to prayer can't get in. Everybody's scared. Doors are locked following an incident Monday night around 8.30 when two individuals walked in after prayers began. They are saying, Assalamu alaikum. They learned those, yeah. And then let them get inside. But once inside, video shows they hurled rocks at worshippers who had their backs to them. Worshippers say the suspects took the rocks that are laid out front by their sidewalk. Looks like these guys are well trained. He says minutes after the first incident, the individuals came back to pelt rocks at them again. Two people were struck in the leg, but no one was injured. We feel really threatened. I don't know, we did not do bother anybody and I got no idea why the people, every religious people have a right to do their religious activity. They're praying for peace and they shouldn't be encountered by violence. I have two individuals, two masked individuals come into this mosque and throw rocks at the congregants is, is just just totally disgusting to me, disgraceful and disgusting. For now, police say they're monitoring the mosque's surveillance cameras and providing extra patrols. The Passaic County prosecutor is investigating. We're going to be reviewing all of the videos. We're going to be talking to anyone who might have any information about it. The prosecutor says it appears at least three individuals were involved. She says once caught, the suspects will be charged with bias intimidation. In Patterson, New Jersey, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. The Council for American Islamic Relations says there have been almost 100 cases of alleged bias intimidation this year in New Jersey. The state is seeing a trend of mosques installing bulletproof windows.